India, the search for economic justice. मैंने बंबई में दो रात भी बिताए एक दिन और एक रात बिताया और मैंने देखा कि वहां पे हमारे देश की बच्चों का क्या हाल है सड़क में बैठी रहती हैं एक दरवाजे में दस लड़कियां बारह लड़कियां और वहां से कह रही हैं बाबू दो रुपया बाबू दो रुपया क्या हमारे देश की बच्ची इसीलिए है क्या हमारे देश की बच्ची का कोई भविष्य नहीं है हम कौन सी इक्कीसवीं सदी की बात करेंगे अगर हम आज इस बच्ची को नहीं बचा पाए तो देर आर मोर देन फाइव मिलियन चिल्ड्रन ऑफ द प्रोस्टिट्यूट इन द कंट्री their condition is particularly pitiable and of great concern because they are forced to live in the brothels and many are forced into the flesh trade at an and a young woman was allegedly gang raped by five men in a moving bus last night the woman and her friend were then thrown off a bus at the flyover the victim is at safarjang hospital in a critical condition joining me on there is no reliable data on the total number of minor girls trafficked from different parts of the country and sold into the brothels gb road in delhi brothels of chennai bahu bazaar and sonagachi of kolkata and finally the largest flesh market of mumbai come on. Two thousand nine witnessed a series of attacks by indian maoists on state security forces And now India's central government is hitting back with a counterinsurgency operation known in the media as Operation Green Hunt. The official anti-mouse campaign includes the deployment of some 75,000 police and paramilitary forces across a swath of territory known as the Red Corridor. We can bring revolution in India and a Maoist one in that. Caught red-handed. A recycling factory in New Delhi raided by social activists with the support of police. The children working here are rounded up and placed into the care of officers and social workers. These children are aged between 6 and 13. The charity which conducted the raid says many of them have been working here for more than a year and have come from other regions of India like West Bengal, Bihar and Uttar Pradesh. Dear's growth. If the children are still enslaved, if they are sold and bought like animals, if they are trafficked like that, if they are confined to workplaces uh this is not the true economic growth this is uh, fair at what cost we wanted to show ourselves that we are growing economy at the cost of children's uh, childhood and dignity and uh, and freedom success the underlying cause still seems to be poverty and it's a subject that any government in this country still finds difficult to tackle so while poverty remains a cause the rates will continue so help me economy वहाँ पर हम रिकन्स्ट्रक्शन कर रहे हैं हमारा योगदान वहाँ वन पॉइंट टू बिलियन डॉलर है भारत अफगानिस्तान है कि वहां पर हम रिकंस्ट्रक्शन कर रहे हैं हमारा योगदान वहां 1.2 बिलियन डॉलर्स है भारत के साथ दूसरे बहुत लोग मिले हुए हैं तो इसके लिए हम लोग मूवमेंट के लिए और फाइट इज टू ब्रिंग जस्टिस एंड टू एस्टेब्लिश अ पीपल्स डेमोक्रेसी What is democracy when people are not fed when people are discriminated against we have political morality on our side so we are sure we will win the people's war but we are not bringing people toward us at gunpoint that is what's being propagated by the government through its corporate media but as the villagers they will tell you how we become popular is it by winning hearts or with guns human rights activists fear the operation will largely target the indigenous rural poor who live in mineral rich areas and that it could resemble the scorched earth campaign used by the Sri Lankan military to defeat the Tamil Tiger rebels we can bring revolution in india and a maoist one in that